Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will explain how to add and use HMI components in Automation Studio. HMI means Human Machine Interface. In Automation Studio, we can use virtual input components and can link them with the circuit diagram. It will give a real look to our control panel circuit and we can control the circuit by using these HMI components. Let's open an already saved DOL starter circuit diagram. This diagram has also three phase indicators, red, yellow, and blue, and has two push buttons on and off as input components, and has also run, stop and trip indicator. Just insert a picture of a control panel's front door and adjust the size. Insert three pilot lights for three phase indicators and change their colors to red, yellow, and blue. Insert on and off push button and give green color to on push button and red color to off push button. Insert pilot lights for run, stop, and trip indication and change the color of stop and trip pilot light to red and leave run pilot lights color green. Add labels to all pilot lights and push buttons by adding text from here. Now link all pilot lights to the circuit diagram one by one. R should link to EA2. Double click on red pilot light and go to internal links and then component link. Choose EA2 and click OK. Same as this, link yellow to EA3 and blue to EA4. Link on and off push buttons to circuit diagram one by one. On push button will be linked to SF1 and off push button will be linked to SF2. Link the run pilot light to EA1, stop indicator to EA5 and trip indicator to EA6. Now all the components that has HMI are added and linked properly. So this front door of panel is look like real and we can control the motor from this panel. Just click on simulation. Turn on the breaker and these three lights are on, showing that the three phase supply is coming to the circuit. Motor stop light is also on, showing that the motor is now stopped. Just push the on push button. Motor is on and running now. Run indicator is now on. If we push the off push button, motor will be stop. So here we are controlling motor from HMI component added to this circuit. We can use all HMI components, they required compatible component exist in the circuit diagram and should link to it. I hope you understood very well. If you have any question, you can ask in comment section. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed my channel, please subscribe it and press the bell icon to get notification of my new videos. Goodbye.